Okay. Attempt number 10, because I'm a professional. Is this echoing? Um, maybe success, maybe success. Okay. All right. <laughs> Sometimes you just need a system restart. Um, okay. <laughs> this has been a this has been a rocky stream. Um already. Let's see if I can Now the one difference here is I haven't actually booted up the game yet. So hopefully it's not related to the game. But I don't think so. Yeah, I, I definitely dream of me. Definitely. Definitely better to have it. You, should, you know, and I had a weird feeling because I was hearing crackling in my audio. And I was like, I don't know what that's about. I thought maybe it was just on my side, but maybe it was all around, I think. Peter was just having trouble. It is a little laptop after all. Safe in Japanese waters. Afraid some local fishermen might harpoon it for scientific research. But honestly, it's quite the power move. Wonder what this is. Um, to make things rockier. Uh, yeah, audio is the hardest thing. Make things a little rockier this stream. I probably won't stream for very long because I'm actually just streaming because I'm blocked with my work work right now. Um, so at any moment, five minutes from now, <laughs> I might just suddenly have to go. Or it could be four hours from now, I don't know. Um, if things get unblocked. But just, just so you know. I did get the game to run fine when I wasn't streaming, but I think the reality um, is that when I'm streaming, it's just going to be a little bit choppy because it's all the same computer. Um, so, it is what it is, uh, I think. So. Probably tweak it more as we keep playing. We'll hash out what Dex Peek out. Oh, there he is. But you are not the masters of your memories, for your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not only to you. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have Echo. resisted the temptation to peek through them? Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life, for them it is all mere spectacle. Let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Oh my god, yeah. Thanks. Totally, no thanks. Jeremy. I loved it. You are beyond salvation. But not the children of the future. Life unseen. We ended up doing five different endings last night. 
we can yet save them. May the mothers shield their bodies. May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed no! masses oh by putting our laughter, our tears, Guys, on full display! Quick, get next to him. I'll snap I don't remember the these being here last time. Secrets. Open your mind before it is too late! Jessica will, like, die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. Yeah, I was really surprised by that too. I mean, I knew there were multiple endings, but I did not expect them to be Let those with ears listen so different. And those with eyes behold. <laughs> Sometimes when games are, people say like, "Oh, the game has like, you know, three endings." They're very subtle. But like me saying five different endings is uh, too late. The different cutscenes is what I mean by that because I think if I were to say actual if different endings, turn a blind eye to their existence, like any variance, the number goes way, way up. Hey V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Yeah. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to so do. So good to just be new playthrough in this. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier living. The world as will and idea. I don't know if I ever read this one. But besides all this, death is the great opportunity no longer to be I to him who uses it. During life, the will of man is without freedom. His action takes place with necessi necessity upon the basis of his unalterable character in the chain of motives, but everyone remembers much that he has done, and an account of which he is by no means satisfied with himself. If now he were to go on living, he would go on acting in the same way, an account of the unalterable nature of his character. Accordingly, he must cease to be what he is in order to be able to arise out of the germ of his nature as a new and different being. Therefore, death loses those bonds. The will again becomes free, for freedom lies in the essi, not the operari. Okay, Dreamer Me, lurk away. Happy to have you here. But we got a new job lined up. From a big hitter at the afterlife. Oh, is it gonna be dangerous? Don't you worry, me, amor. And the meta dwarves. We're bulletproof. Hello, anybody there? And they say I've got my head in the clouds. Earth to be! Hello? Anybody there? Don't mind me, girl. Clients from Group Storyteller. Imbi Scorpio, you did it again. You rolled up your sleeves and cleaned the Augean stables. Everyone admires you, but you know that your only reward will be the next task you're given. There are not many like you in Night City, but without you, the city would have turned into shadows and dust. Avoid. Flirty AIs that try to impress you with their knowledge of ancient Greek. Your lucky place, the net. <laughs> Number two, Capricorn. You're a born corpo. You plot, you plan, you calculate and weave webs so tangled you sometimes lose yourself in them. If only you were the one calling the shots, you would already have the city at your feet. Unfortunately, you're caught up in a maze of responsibilities. But whatever you're plotting, make sure you see it through to the end. Avoid last minute changes to plans. Your lucky place, Arasaka Tower. 
Client number three. Gemini. You know the city like the back of your hand. At night, you head out to just listen to the pulse of the streets, the juicy chatter, muffled screams, and drunken shouts just to soak up the atmosphere. You've been everywhere. You've tried everything. You're a free spirit in a night city that makes you a unicorn. Avoid overworking your lucky place, the newsroom. Client number four, Taurus. You've done your time waiting in the shadows of others, but your patience finally paid off. The applause and flash photography are all yours. The world of media has opened its door to you. Television, radio, brandy, brain dance, net, and this is just the beginning. Avoid the waves crashing at your feet. Your lucky place, the TV studio. Aries. When everyone's, when everyone down and out, you come storming back in style. The city loves people like you. It's how legends are born. Your triumph is bittersweet. You returned, but you've wound up on the street among the joy toys, con artists, and panhandlers. You know you've got biz here to take care of, but it can get tough when it feels like there's no end to it in sight. Avoid sketchy ripper ducks. Your lucky place, Jig Jig Street. The city likes to devour pl players like you, but you know they're kind too well to get up, caught off guard. You're on the ground, you know that the Night City biz only gets done when you put your blood, sweat, and tears into it. Not just flimsy dreams. Okay. <laughs> I have to go in 30 minutes. Good to know. <laughs> Honestly, a very good thing. I don't like being blocked at work. Um, you're on the ground, you know it's... A, okay. So it's not just flimsy dreams. You eat dreamers for breakfast. Avoid genetically modified nuts. <laughs> your lucky place, Haywood. Aries. You've been in the demand... You barely finish one task before someone's lined up to give you another. It often seems that you're on your own, but always remember that you have a team you can count on. Avoid emotional policemen with difficult pasts. Interesting. Your lucky place is a bar inspired by Babylonian culture. While you've been riding with nomads for years, you're a corpo at heart. You knew that from the moment you stepped into Konpeki Plaza, you felt at home there. You've had enough of the camp life, constantly repairing generators, the sand gritting between your teeth. You'd give them up ages ago if you weren't so damn good at it. Avoid the Raff and Shiv, your lucky place, Konpeki Plaza. Note, highly susceptible to the Barnum effect. And Virgo. You've been in the city for only a short time, but you already know the what and the how. You've already accomplished the toughest part. You have a good team at your back. You've just been landing small jobs for now, but you know you're hungry for something bigger. Avoid getting attached to friendly talking machines. You like to place the music scene. Huh. I feel like those are say I've got my probably references to, to characters out in the world to all of this. Giddy. Hi, kitty. 10 out of 10, I can't pet cat. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. We already know this about Ripper Ducks. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. 
Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic. Huh. Guess he used to be a boxer. Bomb, bomb, be dumb, bomb, bomb. Hey, Gratch. He makes himself out to be. I guess that's what these trophies were, too, all along. I remember seeing these and wondering what they were about. But now that I look closer, it's pretty obvious they're about boxing. I am back. I was having, um, like an echo going on. I ended up having to restart my, my computer to get rid of it. V? Ronin from Osaka. Kazuo Kono's name is in the on the lips of everyone in the boxing world. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. No, no, I got you. It was, it was definitely me. I was having a lot of trouble. And I won't be live for much longer because, luckily, it looks like um, I'm going to have a meeting with somebody to try to get myself unblocked from work. <laughs> Unfortunately, that means, you know, not much cyberpunk until later, but that, I still have to wait like 20 more minutes before I can do that, so... Uh, let's see. Name on everyone's list in the boxing world. The up-and-upcoming light heavyweight remains undefeated after 20 professional fights, 17 of which were won by technical knockout. It's always good to have work. Work pays the bills. <laughs> I hate being blocked. I like to work when... Or, like... Because then it means you don't even know when you're going to when you're gonna work <laughs> and then there's a stress of like but when am I gonna work <clears throat> but basically they gave me a uh, a broken build ah the life of a tester uh, some accuse Kano of doping others say he has connections with the Yakuza 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 Yakuza! Yakuza! While training in Night City, the light heavyweight was allegedly seen receiving guests from Japan in his gym. Afterwards, they were then seen being carried out of the gym unconscious. Wyatt's scars have been visible near Kano's ribs for the last three fights. Local Ripper Docs say that the scars definitely do not look like an appendix removal procedure. Will Kano become the light heavyweight champion of the world? We'll see after Malone takes his revenge on Hernandez. There should be a new BTTV emote. Let me see if it got added. Mm, 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 mm. Now I just have the bomb, bomb, beat um stuck in my head. Thanks, Gratch. Thanks a lot. <laughs> X Cal to hustle. See. Nope, I have no idea. <laughs> I tried. I don't know what the. I don't know, it's Z hustle. Of course, it's Z hustle. I don't know why it's a weird one, but it's beautiful, so. <laughs> I 
I wonder what they're implying about these scars that don't look like an appendix removal. I feel like there's something implied there. Sorry, Vic. I'm paying attention to you so much. So much paying attention. What was I... Oh, right. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. It's so weird being a dude. <laughs> really? Now? <laughs> Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Yeah, right, Gratch? Sure, please. Sit down and relax. I feel like it's gonna be harder to tell in, like, those sequences where you kind of hear both voices. That you're hearing both voices. I feel like that Kuroshi worked Optics. better Best when the voice was and should female. should be about right under the circumstances. Because you're just kind of like, now, oh, that's again. a little off-putting. Jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. All right, we already know about cyberware. Let me check what we got here. So we we want this, of course, it's mandatory. Um. Okay. Sorry. Stop telling me. I know. That could be nice. Wow, cyberware. Oh, I didn't know that, Gratch. Good to know. Hmm. Don't think I'm going to get any of these right off the bat this time. I want to get I guess I really have to wait on these but they unlock new quick hacks or new device hacks it doesn't really say what they are but I see what is that four new symbols I think it's the same between these two. Yeah. Quick at cooldown, reduced 45, duration by 40. This damage dealt by hex 20. Interesting. 
These are differently named ones. Definitely, I care a lot more about this stuff for this run because it so heavily affects hacking. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your faces of blur. And just remember, I'll have your to pull up that still show up list I found clear. of like where everything is. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talk to Kuroshi Tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Yeah. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Look how goofy my shorts look at this Feel thing. anything? Same as always. Don't feel a thing. You ask me that every time, you know? Not as if things are gonna be any different today. Sure thing, kid. I mean, not like there's any risk of a stroke or paralysis, but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a doctor. That's what I thought. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in That action. man poked my eyeball. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time for... It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's really I like how it charm. says he's the Who best Ripper Doc. Really? I feel like Scanner it's like biased sync with your thought process tech and read in my eyeball. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. I've never really thought about this, but I guess this might be like another thing. Like it doesn't show up on your map, maybe it's just like or is that the wanted poster ones? <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Yeah, bear, what's happening? Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, Forget where you came from. Guard up, you idiot. The quickest of saves. Oh, yeah, I didn't know that, Gratch. I think I kind of forgot about it, like, as soon as they told me. Last time. Oh, must pet cat. But what they don't. 
Pandemonium! Good job, Co. I think you're just you're you're bombarded with so much information in the opening bits of this game. It seems faster to pick stuff up on the PC. I still got time. I still got time. Okay. Beelzebub's tales to his grandson? Even before our arrival, many beings in Babylon had lost their minds over this subject, while many others were inching closer to the same fate. <laughs> Some of it is wrong. Yes, right, guys. Uh, the burning question of the day, the question that racked the brains of both pitiful scientists and normal beings of Babylon, was this. Do you have a soul or not? There were all sorts of the most fantastic theories on this subject, with new ones appearing all the time, and each and every one of the tempting hypotheses had its supporters. Despite the overwhelming number and diversity of these be beliefs, uh, they were all based on one of two completely opposing premises. The first was called atheism, while the other was uh, idealism or dualism. All dualist hypotheses held the soul existed and, of course, that it was immortal and could suffer many things even after the death of being. Meanwhile, the uh, atheistic theories held the complete opposite view. In short, my boy, when we come to Babylon, we come upon what could only be called constructing the Tower of Babel. Well, isn't it just a quinky dink that this shard is at this location? <laughs> what a quinky dink! The Solos Manual by Morgan Blackhand. Intro. Think you've got what it takes to be a legendary solo, huh? Sure you do. Otherwise, why pick up this book? You're looking for respect, for fear, for a way to be on top. Maybe you heard someone quote me about winning battles with only a glance before a single shot's been fired. Well, fine. I'll let you in on a secret. It is possible, and you can do it too. But only if you got the guts to survive going to hell and back more times than you can count. Thousands of fights, millions of bullets... Hundreds of gallons of blood, yours included. That's what you look, have to look forward to. And you'll need a solid ripper. One you can trust. One you make a lifelong chumba <laughs> bodice out of. One who tells you every week, it's a miracle you ain't dead now. By now. At least, that's what he'll say if you're lucky. Nowadays, every kid with big iron, a, a synth, synth, synth leather, sin, sin leather. I keep trying to... Put a TH on the end of that. Sin leather coat and micro missile launcher thinks they're a hot shot solo. But you know what? Just because you killed a few goons with a smile on your lips don't make you one. Anyone can kill. I know this rocker boy once who blew up a whole fucking platoon of corpo trash. Did that make him a solo? No. It made him dead. So, still think about what it takes to carve your name into solo history? Good. Then this book's for you.
the explorer. And with that, <laughs> I have the shortest stream ever with the longest startup ever <laughs> because I have to go uh, to try and hopefully, hopefully I don't return until uh, tonight. Uh, that will be a good thing because that will mean that I got unblocked. And I got a you know, I, I, I got work that I can do, so. Thank you for being here for this. My dreamer me. Glad you're still here. And hopefully I'll see you guys later. Bum bum dee dum bum bum bee bum bum.